we got? All right. Team Sapphire trying to trying to walk out of here with something under their belt. Is pen over here. Their pen is right here. Oh. You know, it never feels very good to, to walk out of the first week as a, uh, you know, without a win under your belt. It can yeah. be a little disheartening, but, you know, they've played really strong so far. I think there's some good potential here to make something happen. Let's just hope that they're able to do it. They come zipping out real quick. Got an opportunity here. If they, Blitzball's oh, looking for it. Very interesting. Oh, oh is he going to boop him? Just misses the boop oh. opportunity, and they're pushing in the front here. Good view, though. There we go. Ooh, Will, right. sucking up that energy. Already up to 40 almost immediately. Very nice. Oh, but down goes Ignite, too. Bowser not able to make it happen. Trying to keep Link up. Already at 100 energy for Will right there. Really wow. strong, but Hughes getting aggressive. Great play by Sapphire there. Will's going to be leading his team back up to another victory, it looks like. Potentially. It looks like Ruby's it. Ruby's got the point, but we'll see how long it holds for. Will's playing really strong with Blitzball right next to him. Sapphire's looking to pick up this point if they can clear off the uh, clear off Tremulous, which they do. Is Yu's going to go for it? Probably not. Team Sapphire takes over the point. Nice answer. That's a fast answer. Mm -hmm. Yeah, only 20% off the points, so really strong so far. Blitzball's going to be coming in with his all two on his Pharah. Blitzball sees an opportunity here for a concussive shot. If he can get up there in time. Ooh, just a little low. Shockinaut Discord, but still doing damage there off the side. Oh. Roadhog's able to go down, but Blitzball coming in from behind, cleans him up. Wow. It'll be nearly impossible. Oh, and Winston's body goes shooting off into the abyss. Oh, there it goes. Boy. There, there it goes. We go. Oh, oh God. God. Ooh, that's monkey violence. All right. All right. Into the monkey pit. Harambe. Don't never forget. R.I.P. Wow. Really strong out there. Now we got Will. Might do a little special tactics if he's sneaky with it. Let's there see. it is. Nice. Love that. Wow. So even though he did that, oh, how'd they oh. get booked off? Was it enough? I thought Wasn't that was going to go. Yeah, I thought that was going to drop everybody, actually. But, you know, it's going to still be a challenge for Ruby to take this point. Wow. It's not impossible. No. The current really making something happen. The current is hungry. Oh, oh nice oh, shot. God. Be enough. Yes, it is. Also, nice shot. Really good moves here on this McCree here. Oh, yeah, he is on point. So we got Sapphire though bringing the point to 77%. If they can do a real hard push here and shut out Ruby and add a little scatter, we could really see them uh, taking over the point here. We got some fans in there for shock and awe, for obvious reasons. Doing some serious damage. Got Team Sapphire though prepping in the back here. Other teams oh, kind yeah. of out of position right there, but yeah, Rogue Sleep picks up Ninja. And they're all hurting with that debuff aura. Blitzbolt goes down. Kind of in a tough situation here, you know. They want to be able to push in. Get like everybody Ruby. back up. No, they, yeah, they backed up a little bit. That was good. You gotta watch Yug's shield there. Oh, they're gonna regroup. Looks like they're gonna regroup. Go the same route. Yes, yes. Yes, they are. Those look like it, but Sapphire keeps getting picked. Ignite 2 just decides Bowser's just going in there. Good, Bowser. Oh, no! Link managed to pick up you, but not enough. Oh, Ninja's getting hunted down. Doing a great job pulling him down here. We're getting a little bit of a trickle here. Yeah, they better be careful. Starting to see that, that uh, last game fatigue, I think. Absolutely. Definitely start to see it at the end here as teams just are desperate to make something happen. They're at 90% though. Hold on. Will. Will. Whoa, there we go. Blitzbolt in on the point. Wow. Managed to pick it up, but Shock and All counters it back. Ninja's going to have his all. Pops it. Zip it around the point. Picks up. Tremulous. Picks up another. And another. Ninja's just totally working this fair. Is he able to get the last yes. shot? And he does. Wow. At the 99%. Sprays for. If that doesn't get play of the game. <laughs> I. 
All right, here we go. Link's got his alts up, but they've got loss up and a Curran's as well. The McCree alts, good, but not as good as other ones. We'll see if he's able to make it work. 80% on Will right now. Link's got to make this all work, and he's hoping to get a little boop here. Don't get too Ooh, aggressive. Nails Don't get the too wall. Aggressive. Drop seal. Drop Keeps seal. him up. Here we go. I would 99%. almost say a little early on that alt. It was no. right on time, man. So? All right. Look at this. They're holding well. Tremulous pops out. He's getting picked off. Blitz going to work. Fair on fair action. And this is going to Team Sapphire. Wow. Nice work, Sapphire. Very well done. Took control of the point quickly after that first loss and then just ran it right back at him. Really good play. Very good. Again, we saw almost the slip of the patience and discipline that we saw earlier, but they quickly recouped and were able to kind of take control. The trickle always makes me worried. Absolutely. We noticed on that last, on you know, the game before this with Jade and Onyx that Jade just wasn't able to get stable and Onyx was just beating them up. And we kind of started to notice that with Team Ruby, but somehow Sapphire was able to make some plays. Blitzbolt coming in there on the point, dropping his ult, getting up behind him, really helped stabilize and move him ahead. So we see Blitzbolt opting for this Genji play here. Um, we're going to see how well it works out. Um, he had really good Farah play. Maybe he feels like Farah's not going to be as strong as, uh, as a Genji pick here. We'll see if it plays off. Good response on Bowser's hook there. He gets slapped right away and Free Straws goes down. Ooh, big Ooh. shots in the Never turn there. your back on Let's a Roadhog. Pick it up two. Oh, wow. Tremulous answering back, though. You know, this Zarya can be really strong, though, against a, uh, a D.Va, and that's not going to be good for uh, for Tremulous. Absolutely. But they've uh, sacrificed the point, which allows Ruby to just immediately start getting points on that. You know, that's... You want to be careful with that. These are all free percentage points that could have either been contested or potentially given to Sapphire. Yeah, because they're fighting practically on point here. It wasn't as if they were that far off. Right, yeah, exactly. But either way, Sapphire looks like they're easily going to reclaim the point just like last game and stabilize. Same strat, disciplined approach, though. See the current switch over to a tracer this round. Absolutely. We'll see how that works out for him. Ooh, Bowser, a little bit out of position, especially with oh, this tracer, look but out. really smart play there. Gets the bubble yeah. and then is able to heal through it pretty easily. Again, that's uh, Will there. And he's able to get a pick. Will's yeah. uh, Ignite 13. Yep. Oh, I'm serious. Saying. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. The Zarya bubble. Coming in, trying to make something happen, but Link pops his alt, keeping everybody up. Shocking all up there. Wait. Wow. He's waiting. He's thinking, I'm going to have a great alt opportunity, but he blasts oh, himself he in the face. We're going to slowly uh, zoom away yeah. from him on that one. We'll pretend like that didn't <laughs> yeah. happen. Yeah. And he's going to remain up there, it looks like, waiting for his team to stabilize for an alt opportunity. Yeah. And Sapphire is halfway through this point right now. What's that Roadhog doing over there? Bowser's been playing pretty aggressively up front. And it's been working with the Zarya bubble, and he's pretty smart about Look it. He's looking Shock for a pick off. right there. Right yeah. up there. He's waiting. Well, they if you don't saw Shocking on the current, it looks like he's coming up behind there. Plunges himself aggressively oh, oh. over. Careful there. See what oh, he's wow. trying to do. And he, he gets a ground alt. Impressive. The ground alts we don't definitely don't see very often, no. but they're scary. Link picking up a bunch on the point is really able wow. to hold his own here. And he gets taken down eventually by Dekiran and That's a Lucio that uh, wants to take people down as well as heal them. She got an interesting opportunity here for Team Sapphire. We can get Will's alt up. You know, you can definitely retake the point well, and at 85%, that could be the game right there. Ooh, trying to push him from the back. Jet Li getting behind there, picks up Loth. That's a healer down. We got an ult coming out there. And Tremulous blows up the point wow. while Shock and all picks him up along the edges. Tremulous again, nailing that D.Va ult. Absolutely, we've seen some phenomenal D.Va ults right now. You know, a big weakness of the Sapphire team, which I think Tremulous is exploiting, is the fact that there's no shields for them to hide behind. Yep. When this D.Va ult goes live, they need to be hiding behind a barrier. Gotta scatter. 
That's your only option. Yeah. So then when you also have a Pharah, you can just fly up and snipe all that stuff down. So it makes for a powerful combination. All right, we got a alt potentially coming out of Link here. He can connect that with the Genji, but you got to have good communication with Free Straws or else you're going to end up both alting and wasting them. So we'll see how well these teammates are able to combine and communicate. Looks like they're doing it. You got Free Straws Blitzball leading coming it. Coming in hard, alting, just slicing them apart. They still got Link's alt What's as Link well. What's Link going to do? Hold Hopefully on to it. Hold, it. hold on to it. Scanning for that Pharah. But Pharah is dead. He killed himself. <laughs> oh boy. Maybe we, we spoke too highly about Shock and Awe. I know. Jinxed it. <laughs> we got an alt from Will here. He's probably going to try and alt the front of the point here. Here we go. Yes, exactly. he but is. Trying to pull him back. Oh, a panic alt. Might not be that panicked. It's, ah. it's working out pretty well. Blitzball. Already gonna have his ult back up though, and he is really doing well with this Genji. Got his ult back up, gets shielded by Will instantly. They're doing a great job here. Sapphire. And it looks like yeah. Sapphire's got it. Yeah. Wow. Nice, nice. work, Sapphire. So Sapphire really holding their own here. You know, they got beat pretty soundly in that last match, and it looks like they're back to really push it back. Yeah. They do not want to lose. Yeah, like nobody wants to lose, but they look they hungry. really don't. Like I was saying, you know, it's important that you want to end this first week on a somewhat of a high note. So even if you don't win all of your matches, if you're able to walk away with at least something under your belt, something to hang your hat on, you can really build up from that. When you walk away, 0 and 3 out of a match can be a little disheartening. Really good matches, though. Oh yeah, these are definitely back and forth, good combinations. I like them. And here we go, both teams matching in the front side here. Again, more really good boop opportunity here on this point. So, Team Sapphire makes a move quickly for the point, but they're gonna leave behind their soldier, potentially. Unless he was able to sneak on the point and I missed him. Flex that fire strike all the way back, and look at that all wow. charge already all the way up to 55 percent off to 60. Wow, 60. that's impressive it's gonna be huge ninja blows himself up but it appears to be worth it lost the last one alive and he's not gonna oh, no. the curin's the last one alive he's yeah. not gonna last nope Whoa. oh blitz ball oh wow Some that was really pretty cool fancy moves but you know they We're still don't have the point oh uh, that's upsetting so he launched himself a little bit too far there. And they got it now, though. So Sapphire is able to claim that. And he's got his ult as well, Blitzbolt does. Really strong play out of him this game. I'd say he's another one of the standouts of this match right here. He's really carrying Team Sapphire this Genji play. Really good flex play, too, from him. He's going to ult behind these guys and... Ooh, gets picked up Ooh. though. Here we go. Probably He's looking up. for a bubble, but gets slapped. No, gets no. Completely taken out. Shut down. Really good counter by uh, Team Ruby there. The now we know watching be... Ninja's ult is very mesmerizing as Soldier. It really does a great job of spreading that damage out. They scatter. Oh, Ninja gets picked up. Oh no. Trying to deal with Tremulous. Oh, not like this. Oh. Team Ruby takes this point back. All right, Ruby's putting up a fight. They're not going to go easy. Yeah. Team Sapphire is able to get this last 50%-ish. They are looking to pick this game up, but Ruby's not going to go down without a fight. They're going to be able to deal with the Curin's Tracer blows his ult. Ooh. That missed hook is always upsetting. Ooh, big ult opportunity there. Wow. We're going to see what they can do. Tries to land. Of his alts, but not enough. Loth go down as well. It's looking like Team Sapphire is going to be able to clean this up, assuming Maybe. that they can finish off these last there two they tanks, go. which they do. Well, they did. I mean, they managed to take out their squishies immediately, as they should have. 
So now the question though is if Sapphire reclaims a point, are they going to be able to hold for the next one or two pushes? Ruby goes quick, they're going to have two big push opportunities here. But Ninja picks up Loth, who takes out their healer. They're coming in from the backside. Link with the boop, misses it, gets taken oh. out instead. That hurts a lot. But Blitzball coming up with another alt. Is he going to be able to do something though? Nope. That was a good switch to that Winston, and that's really going to be an issue for Blitzball as they reclaim the point. Wow. All right. Well, let's see if Link can get a successful boop off this round. That's well, the hope here. Free Strauss picks up the cure, and now they're going to be one up here. This is going to be good. If they can, for Sapphire, if they're able to push up here, they should be able to reclaim this with a 5v6 advantage. He's got an opportunity here. Pop this at the right time. Free Strauss is down, so they are down a healer right now. Down two. Drop it. Okay. Drops it. Just misses a couple targets. Going to be enough. Loth answers that. I don't think it's enough. They're going to be evened up here. They got to back up and reclaim their opportunity. You know, Tremulous made an unbelievably smart play there. He switched to Winston. Winston's can be very devastating against Genji's, even really strong Genji's. Blitzball's not responding to that. Staying is Genji, staying on it. We are going to have another alt opportunity out of this Zarya here from Will. And Blitzball picks up the kill on him, but it's at the cost of his own life. Here we go, he's trying to get that alt charge up. And he does. And he pops oh, it. Is there wow. any follow-up, though? And there really isn't. No He's the only one up on up. that. Oh, no. Will's not going to be able to take the point, and Team Ruby's able to pick up one game here. Wow. Really close game there. I, honestly, I'm shocked that uh, Ruby was able to pick that up there at the end. Are the guys good? We're probably going to run over a few minutes. All right, we're gonna see if Team Sapphire is able to lock this down or not. So, you know, I'm, my heart goes out to Team Sapphire. I'm hoping they're able to do it, but we will see. See if they can break the streak, because we heard uh, Team Fire went undefeated. They were our season one champs. And uh, people are saying this Team Ruby. Yeah, and Loth was part of that Team yeah. Fire one of their supports and he's kind of showing that again this time as well. Blitzball opting again for this Genji despite being answered. Being answered by the Winston but you know really good plays by him but not enough unfortunately. You know it's all this back and forth team comp things you know we've got a Zarya that is strong against the Winston. But the Winston's strong against the, the Genji, the so Genji. you know it's hard to decide. You know which one, where, where do you go with that? Ninja gets picked up by Loth and Muse is down. Tremulous being really aggressive over there. No one's contesting Shock and Awe. He's just up there. Yeah, Shock and Awe. It's like no one's playing with him. What's going on? Ah, oh, there we go. A fair that's uncontested is going to be hard to deal with, and it looks like Ruby's going to pick up this first point. Wow. Blitzball doing a really good job just zipping around that point, making it uncomfortable. They still weren't able to claim that over all that time thanks to Blitzball's play. And now they're starting to come in, but Ruby is able to pick up that point. And Bowser's trying to get back there with some good hooks. But isn't able to make anything connect right now. Ninja splitting off from the team a little bit, trying to see if he can get something with his alt here, I assume. Ooh, launches a rocket, but a little bit of a miss there. Tremulous coming in hot. Not going to be able to survive that. There we go. Alt's going to be coming down shortly. He wants to pick up the... Yeah, there, there we, we go. go. So he wants to pop that alt, buy no. some time to really make his work. Yeah. Link pops his defensive alt. Nice job. Ninja gets his down too. Targets that Farah. Sapphire really, really making things work here. Well, Tremulous is in, but that's a, lot a six of I was like, that is a lot of good communication going on right there. Absolutely. Really good plays there by these guys. We got another, we got some more people voting here for uh, Team Sapphire to come back up. Oh, yeah. 
It's not even come back up. It's just finish the game up, I guess. Because they've been playing very well. Oh, yeah. We're going to see what they're able to do here to, to keep this going. Picks up Hughes, coming around the backside. They're pushing on the middle. Ignite 13 shuts down the Winston. Tremulous goes down. Really open oh. up a lot of space for Blitzbolt, but he's got to be careful. He's getting Ooh, hurt real Blitzbolt's bad. Blitzbolt's got to be conservative. Be careful. Getting way having a little bit of trouble in those close corridors. He backs up. But the Tracer's just relentlessly Tracer. trying to make something happen. Wow. Picks up the Ferris somehow. And the and Tremulous. Wow. Blitzbolt, again, having a phenomenal game right here. Yeah. Really helping to guide his team to where they need to be. Really strong play out of him. He's definitely one of our newer players in the league and definitely having a strong first showing here. Yeah. All right, they're making their strong push forwards here, led by Hughes. Hughes is Shield getting ready. going down. Hughes, really aggressive charge there. Into, wow. Into the fight, but kind of opens up the team. But again, look at that. Will so steps high in energy. front, gets it. Oh, my. Picks it up, look and now, that. as a Winston, you just got to die. Got to die fast. Yeah. You got 20% left. Yeah. You got to respawn, get collected, and get back there. But again, who's all the way up there? Is that Blitz again? Yeah. Uh, yeah. So he's wow. up here. He's going to have his ult. He's probably thinking. Yeah. Thinking coming behind. Oh, That's going to hurt But he them. gets blown up right away, right back. Yeah. So both DPS are out. Yuke's coming in hyper aggressive, trying to stay up. Ninja, maybe a little early. Loth answers with that. Oh, but. You know, Loth made that exact same play in the final yes. of the last game. Didn't work this time, though. As it looks like, oh. Team Sapphire is going to be able to take this point and walk and away with at Sapphire least the win. Sapphire gets at least one win on the board. Yeah, there's yeah. no way. Nice job. Team wow. Sapphire had a great game there, and it ended up working out for him. Wow. Really good plays there. Got high fives all around for wow. Team Sapphire's Ninja leads now, his team. Now, which Ninja play is this? Oh, it's this one. This is where he baits out the all yeah. from Loth, comes back around, shreds up, picks up the Pharah. Such good heads up play. It's like mechanical precision with him on that all. Just the most effective way to distribute that damage. And it's wow. the difference between a really strong soldier player and a weaker soldier player. He baits, he doesn't bait it out, he forces out yeah. the Zenyatta alt, which completely makes his ult a million times better. Look at that high energy kill, 65 to limbs. Will, another great play this time. Really strong 